Hey there, welcome back to Old World Home. My name is Hillary, if we have never met, and I wanna welcome you to our Christmas home tour for 2021. We live on the East Coast in the US in the New England area, and I am constantly being inspired by the New England aesthetic, that sort of classic American Ralph Lauren style. So that is kind of the elements that I have incorporated into our home and specifically into our Christmas decor this year. So I hope you enjoy the tour. The kitchen sees a lot of action when you're a family of six and even more so at Christmas time. When it comes time to decorate this space, I love to use practical everyday items to bring in those pops of red and then add fresh greens up high so they don't add any clutter to our really hard working counters. An orange and clove simmer pot is a stove staple all month long and it just makes the house smell amazing. Christmas in the kitchen also means lots of cookie baking, so these practical jars on the counter get dressed with simple festive ribbons every year. One of our favorite family traditions is hanging this cinnamon applesauce reindeer garland above the window. This is such a fun and easy DIY and I can link to my tutorial video. Over on this side of the kitchen we keep fresh fruit in silver bowls and a set of cookie tins ready to be filled and shared with loved ones. Above the fridge I have this oversized thrift store basket that I filled with some fresh magnolia and dried crepe myrtle buds to tie in with the magnolia above the window. Over in the dining room, I again kept things easy and just simply embellished what was already there. I tucked in more sprigs of magnolia into the silver platters and hung a star banner that I found at a yard sale. These clove oranges are such a timeless and fun activity to do with the kids and they just look so beautiful on this brown transfer wear. Decorating these gingerbread houses made quite a mess, but it's all part of creating those precious Christmas memories. And this space also doubles as my wrapping station, so I keep paper and other trimmings in this thrifted basket, as well as a stack of neighbor gifts wrapped and ready to be given. I just love how warm and cozy our living room becomes this time of year. Now that the kids are getting older, they had so much fun decorating the tree and adding all their own little special embellishments, including this popcorn garland that we made last year and it lasted again till this year. And the tree is filled with special themed ornaments that I collect each year for each of our four kids. The mantle may be my very favorite part of our entire house. It was handmade by my husband and it just looks so gorgeous, decked out in fresh greens, magnolia, those dried flower stems, and these faux pears. The candle sconces are new, they're colonial reproductions, and I found them at a yard sale this summer. And then the flameless candles are also a new addition and I love them. I will link to them down below. Our stockings have also been lovingly collected over the years as our family has grown. The wall of built-ins was also a vision of mine that my husband amazingly brought to life and I just absolutely love decking it out for Christmas. Simple red velvet ribbons dress up anything and everything and the nativity that I found last year at a thrift store is set to receive their king on Christmas morning. Our Christmas book collection also continues to grow every year and pretty much all of them come from yard sales and thrift stores and I just love how even our everyday decor sparkles with the glow of Christmas. In the hallway, more red ribbon and sprigs of pine dress up our everyday things. Since
since we do have a newborn in the house this Christmas, I kept the decor very simple in the kids' rooms with just a few special touches. One of our favorite things that the girls and I did together was decorate their little calico critter house with the sweetest little decorations and even some lights to enjoy at night. In the boys' room, I decorated above the changing table with more greens and ribbon on a set of bells that were gifted to us by a very dear friend. And of course, another yearly tradition, this sweet nativity set on our vintage baby scale. I did an entire video about decorating our bedroom for Christmas, adding in this sweet mistletoe, punches of plaid, and more greens in that classic Ralph Lauren style. Last but not least, we put up a second tree in our sunroom and filled it with more of the kids' ornaments and others that I collected over the years. This watering can was actually a recent thrift store find for just a couple bucks. And on this side, we have a secondhand desk, a vintage red wool throw, and our nature collections. A pair of vintage skates and my son's red mittens finish off this sweet three season room. If you are new to my channel, be sure to stick around and subscribe. I have plenty more Christmas content. I am doing Vlogmas this month where I am sharing a video every day in December leading up to Christmas. So I hope you will stick around and enjoy those videos as well. Thanks so much for watching and I'll be talking to you soon. Take care guys.